Hi friends, my name is Kelsey and I'm the team manager and co-driver for the Cooper Auto Works Rally Team. I'm really excited to share with you today the many ways my racing team uses science, technology, engineering, and math within our racing program. The first subject I want to cover with you today is science. Buckle up for this first one. We're gonna see some real examples of how physics apply to racing. And it's thanks to our understanding of physics that we're able to control this car at really high speeds. Let's go. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> What does this stack of tires, this can of gas, and this jug of oil have in common? Chemistry. Chemists specially develop tire compounds for better grip, fuels that are more efficient, and oils that can provide better lubrication inside the engine at very high temperatures. Behind me here is an engine that's been pulled out of a car. And engines run on the chemical reaction of combustion. That combustion reaction happens inside of these cylinders. And that's what powers your car. There's some really amazing technology inside of our race cars. Each car has an engine control unit inside, and this is a computer that controls the car's engine. We can plug this into a laptop and actually program the engine. This process is known as tuning. And once we're done tuning a car, we can actually test its performance on a dynamometer. A dynamometer measures how much horsepower and torque a car produces. Engineering covers the design and building of structures, engines, and machines. And if we think about it, a car is a machine with an engine. And inside, there's a very important structure. That's the roll cage. Engineers use their understanding of math and science and apply it to the things they build. A roll cage is a great example of engineering because it requires an understanding of both physics and geometry in order to build a structure out of metal tubing that can distribute the forces of a crash. We're back at my computer desk to talk about the subject of math. Now, when I was your age, I didn't much care for the subject of math and I didn't think that I was very good at it. But once I got older and learned how math applied to racing, well, I figured out that I actually love the subject and I'm really good at it. The formula that I use the most is the time, speed, distance formula. I use this formula a lot to calculate how fast we went down a stage or to figure out how long it's going to take us to drive a certain number of miles so that we can arrive everywhere we need to be on time. Another formula I use a lot is calculating how many miles per gallon our car uses so that I know how much fuel to put in the race car. I hope you had as much fun as I did learning about how important science, technology, engineering and math are in the field of motorsports.